Hello, welcome back to Cuphead. It's been a long old while, I'll tell you that. So I think what we should start with is something probably super difficult. What's in here? Sugarland Shimmy. Did we even try that? Baroness von Von Bon. Yes. All right, why don't we start with that? Let's not even check our weapons or anything. We'll just get the Brawler Brewing. And remember how we play. Jump. I don't, I don't even remember how to shoot. We shoot with that button. That's cool. Okay. We're back on. And immediate flirt alerts. What's dash dash is B? All right, what's X? I can't remember what that is. Anastasi, ah, a bit of story to make today better. Bless you, thank you so much. I'm not sure I make anything better myself, but uh, I do appreciate the, the love. I appreciate the love. The loving kind of guy. All right, we've got the, du the duck shoot down. That's fine. We managed to get that, which is great. Now, what's special shoot? That must be this. Yes, it is. Oh, that was close. I've got to save the uh, the big the big guns for when we're up in the bit. That's really good timing for that. Oh my goodness! All right, we're looking all right at this point, aren't we? Come on, chase me! Stop trying to chase me and chase me. Go! That's a good start. Sugar. No! Oh, that was such a good start! Yeah, it wasn't that great. I thought I'd have done more damage to it there, you know. But hey, not bad. Not bad. <laughs> Anyway, welcome, welcome to those of you who haven't um, caught me live before or haven't seen me live for a while. Lovely to have you here. You get to witness me kick rear end um, very, very quickly here. Whoops, wrong button. You're going to hear that a lot. Whoops, oh, that's not the button, Steve. Whoops, oh dear. No chance. No chance, right. We start off by killing the first little jelly bean that comes out. Not bad for the first try of the stream. Right, thank you. That's what I was thinking. Can't quite get that one, that's a shame. Can get that one. It's because I'm fresh. It's because I'm fresh. Oh no, I killed it. Damn. That's the, that's the best try I'm going to have all stream. <laughs> you realise that. So you've got to be ready for those jelly beans. That's the main thing. What are we going to have as the last one? Gobstopper. Oh no, it's the gumball machine. I'm definitely okay with that. Definitely all right with gumball. Ah, don't press dash though. <laughs> when, you're, when you're trying to actually not dash. Do that. There you go. Oh dear. Not the best. Come on. Got one of those though. That's nice. So if we keep shooting it now, do that. Now we've got one health to last us. These heads are really tricky. It's going to come after me. It always comes after you. Ooh, that one did. <laughs> right, okay. We'll exit to the map. Hang have I completed that level already? Hang on. How do I t I have. It's got the cup thing there. I'm such an idiot. This shows how long it's been since I last played. Well, it's a good good place to practice again, right? But yeah, the, the, the cup um, <laughs> that you can see just at the top of there, the cup flags there. Thanks, Anastasia, for, for reminding me that I beat it. No one else bloody remembered. Welcome, Ringo. Oh, shall we? I think we shall. <laughs> well, it's a good place to try, isn't it? Maybe that's what, that's what I was doing. That's what I was doing. I was actually trying to... Uh, <clears throat> trying that out. Oh. Bloody heck. Um, yeah, I definitely need the uh, the dash through thing for this. I'm not quite sure how you... Hmm. That's not the right button. How do I switch weapons? There it is. 
Need some of that going. Get used to this one again. Going okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going okay. I've, I've had some worse um, thingies. Some, some, some worse uh, attempts at this. It's, uh, it's all practice though, isn't it? Oh, no, that wasn't so great. Some worse parries, that's what I was trying to say. Antoine said it first. Sorry. Oh, yes, you did. Yeah, well. Okay, so again, we need to exit to the map and we need to change out. What is it we've got? We've got an extra hit point, but we want the invisible dash. Because then we can dash through the guy. At Super Art 1, we don't have any other options there. Chaser is what I've got. That's really useful. Yeah, pea shooters. Good for the rest of it. A great Thank you, Anastasi, very, very much for the donation and for the support and for the good luck. Appreciate the hell out of it. That yeah, jumping was great there, Steve. That would definitely help. I suppose I could... Um... Yeah, there we go. I suppose there I could use the, uh, the ultimate fire as well, this thing. Yeah. I let them... Uh... Congregating in the bad in a bad way there. Those dogs, not good. I assume you're able to hear me, all right? No one said otherwise. And if no one says otherwise, then I just assume. Yeah, that's how it goes. Assumptions all round. Well, that's a good start. Oh no, it's that. Okay, that's fine. They're all going to hit. Don't need to worry. Oh no. Oh! And he does that too. Right, he's relearning this. We got halfway through. Not, not who's there, Charlie Horse, Charlie Horse, who. You have to play for three hours until my lunchtime. It's not even lunchtime. Now what? Have some of that. Because then we get the ducks and we get you. It's all, it's all great. Yeah, and then we don't need to worry about trying to aim for those awkward ducks. Sugar. Right, we lost our health, but we we did get a parry point, so that's nice. You're on the bog, Wolf. <laughs> that's good to hear. Glad I can be your your toilet entertainment. Oh, it's it's funny actually when you rely on the um, the homing things like I've got here too much. You tend to find that you don't start dodging quite as well. Oh, that's up there. Hey, Mac Fix. I am unlikely to play a scary game anytime soon. Oh, sugar. Simply because, um, and this is for you know anyone else watching or or watching afterwards or wondering. Um, it's just too much stress, and I don't really enjoy playing them. Uh, and it means that I just sort of burn out and not play stuff for absolutely ages, <laughs> like I have done in the past. So, I hope that makes sense. But yeah, so no no scary things anytime soon, most likely. I hear there are some inter there's a couple of interesting scary games out at the moment. What does this do? It just does that. That was a waste. Oh well, that, that's fine. It's good to know. So yeah, there's a couple of scary games out at the moment that maybe I could think about. Terrible attempt at parrying. Isn't good. Yeah, people keep talking about phasmophobia. It's like, but all it is is just walking through a scary house and stuff just jumping out on you and scaring you in the dark. Um, like that sounds like my idea of hell, if I'm honest. It's really horrible. There we go. That's a good start. Didn't lose any health. Is this, is this? Hey, Dweirdo. Yeah, people keep mentioning phasmophobia. Some people call it phantasmophobia. Maybe that's what I called it before. I don't know. <laughs> 
See, I, I barely got to the, the final sort of stages of this one. Because it's really tricky, obviously. Still no health lost. I mean, I realise I'm tempting fate somewhat by saying that. To believe in such things. But that's pretty decent. Oh, just jump straight into it, Steve. Superb. Alright, that's good. That's good. We can handle that. Just have some of that. Have some of that. I am now nervous. Because <laughs> I have one health. That's great. That's great. We'll parry that. Try not to get hit by anything here. Oh my goodness. What was that? Do I have to be careful of that? No. Alright, we're, we're through to the next phase. Shame I lost two health on stuff that's really easy. But whatever. Barely ever get to this phase. I'm going to stand over here. These things. I can jump on. My goodness! Okay, that's fine. Because I can jump on them in order to save myself. That's good. We like it. We like it. Now we need to spend more time on that phase to practice it. But that's the furthest I think I've ever got. So the, the, so we learned on the final phase of this clown thing. What do you call a cup that falls off a swing, by the way? A tumbler. We've learned this. We've learned in this that the train comes, the, the roller coaster comes around a lot faster. So you've got to be uh, ready for that. But you can spend probably the entire thing on those swinging what's it. And those things that come out, they've got a kind of weird, like the cupcake head man in the other one a thing to them. So that's cool. Thanks, Matt Fix. No, I really appreciate it. And I know, I know, like, it's very easy for me to go, oh, I'm not. Oh, you know what? I'm not, I'm not. Not gonna do that one. Good I know it's very easy to say, oh yeah, I'm not playing horror games anymore because it's too scary and I don't like it. And just, you know, that's that's it. But I, I do get that people people, you know, that's why a lot of people subscribe. That's what a lot of people want to see. And that's cool. And I, I I've watched horror YouTubers who sort of didn't want to play horror anymore and went, Oh, come on, why don't you play horror anymore? It's so much fun. Um but now I'm in that boat, I kind of get it. <laughs> So, yeah, I apologise, I guess, for that, to an extent. There's no need to apologise, and I know lots of people say, don't apologise, just do what you want. But I, do, I get it, you know. And there's a sort of an implicit understanding that I might carry on playing more at some point, isn't there? Because that's what I started doing, and I've never really given proper reasons why to many people in videos or whatever. So, that's the reason. I hope you can understand that. We've got this this bit down now, I think. Especially with this weapon. This weapon's super helpful. Nice. We'll try and get past this next one as fast as we can. Okay, watch those. Have fun on that. Have fun on that. I really don't like that, because you're not invincible when you use your special there. Not at all. Oh, and you run into it like a plonker, Steve. What a plonker. And I run into it again. They fall so slowly. It's their fault. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, no, apologise is a big word, but you know what I mean. I, I feel... I feel you. Let's just put it that way. I, I, I get it. And I am... Um, Regretful. There you go. Regretful that I don't want to play that stuff anymore. However, that, as I say, that's not... I really need to pay more attention. Right, we'll, we'll use this as a trial run. I'll stop talking in a minute. But we, I, I am regretful, and, you know, it's not a never. It's not going to be never. And then we dive into a dog. Brilliant. Right, we're going to pay attention this time. Almost messed that up. <clears throat> I was nervous of the light bulb there. We're good. I think we're good. Nervous of the light bulb. Yeah, we're good. Come on. Be done with it. Damn. Well, we got him. Ooh, that was 
close. I really need to stop shooting the pink balloons and try and obtain some of them with parries. Difficult with this weapon, though. And also, I just do that, so stuff it. They're really difficult to get. I can get the nosy very easily, but uh, getting those things, the dogs, the pink dogs, are actually quite tricky, I find. Good. Now uh, we got we got quite a bit of health. Do one of those. Good start. Because I feel that this this phase is the one that has most chance for damage. That was decent, Steve. Decent stuff. Less decent because you're on a train that's moving backwards constantly. Good. One health. <laughs> now we swap over to these, I think. Get one of them. I wish that gave me health. Oh gosh. It's the penguins. Battle of the penguins. Okay, wow, they're all throwing baseballs at me. We're halfway through there again. So they throw baseballs that seem to go in the same sort of method as the dogs do. So I somehow need to avoid those. Possibly stay up there while they do all their getting into place. And then as soon as they get there, I can go to one side, preferably the left-hand side, and start jumping up and down to avoid those because they come on a single trajectory. So we'll see. Sorry, Pink Duck. I meant to hit you instead. But by accident, I hit you. Oh, and that one got me with the lamp. The light bulb. Shank. Ah, didn't get that one. Yeah, the, uh, this this weapon is absolutely superior for this, le this level. <clears throat> Glad I got that pink one. Pink doggo. Mmm, poor jump. Poor jump. Poor attempt at uh, a thing. That's alright. That's okay. We're doing alright there. We've got one health, which is a shame, but... Ah, have I just screwed myself? Because they're going to come back. No, I haven't screwed myself with fine. That's good. Also good. Yes. Happy with this. Thus far. Should have got the pink one, really, but I'm, I'm just nervous. Oh, we got we got one health. Uh, well, we're making it to the final stage most, I'd say, most times today. We've only had a handful of attempts, but when we're having proper attempts, we're getting there most times, it feels. Yeah, and no, I think we'll stick with this this weapon though, because it's it's definitely the best. We'll stay up here for this as well. Right, this is where we're going to do this. Wow, they just come for you. Okay. <laughs> we're learning. We're learning apparently. We're learning and learning. Thanks for coming, JB Stephen. Lovely to see you too. Hey, gotcha. Schwein. Ooh, that's close. Ooh, that was close as well. Oh, made it. Made it, no health lost. Even got a pink ducky for our troubles. Ooh. Oh, I shot the damn dog by accident. Getting ready to jump on him for a parry. Shot him by accident, and that just ended up meaning that I missed the nose as well. <laughs> so, took damage. Shame. Got that. That's nice. Now, one thing I don't know is, does, does the boss's health roll over throughout uh, from phase to phase so like if I pumped my great big 
Um, okay. If I pump my great big weapon into him now... Don't hurt me. Yeah, didn't hurt. Good. If I pumped it into him um, at the last phase, would that affect this guy's health if it killed him last phase? That's what I'm thinking. Like, does does extra damage overkill from phase two last into phase three as well? Anyone knows? That would be great, because that's a little strategic thing that I could follow. Two health on this final bit is nice. Not bad. Okay, they're all coming. They're all coming. That's fine. Oh, I can kill them, though. That's good to know. All right, cool. So I can actually kill the penguins when they're up. I mean, I'm feeling all right here. Oh! oh! Look at that! I was so close. Right, we've got this. We've got this. We can use the same weapon the entire time. We've absolutely got this. It's on. You're absolutely right, it's on. Yeah. Yes! Oh! I'm feeling dexterous today. Is this good? <laughs> last. Famous last words. Yeah, we're going to get it this episode. Probably. <laughs> no guarantees. Oh, come on. Ah, the parries are so difficult sometimes with these things. Well, got one there. Is that going to hit him? It is. Lovely. Straight into a dog. Got to remember that. No one has mentioned if the damage carries over from hey, one phase into another. If anyone can tell me in the comments, <clears throat> watching afterwards, if anyone knows, then that'd be amazing. Excuse me, sniffity stiff. Don't look sniff. No! I meant to get the ducky, not kill the ducky. Right. Thanks, Amy. Thanks, Ruru. You both believe in me. Oh. I am believed in. Don't ever go left after bouncing off that, even if there are dogs around, Steve. Don't try and get the dogs that are too low to the ground either, because that's lots of health you've just lost for no good reason. Hey, got that. And that's... A shame. I forget you can't aim that one up. That big super fire thing. It is. It is. I should probably just swap the weapon out, actually. They're all yellow ducks. Damn it. Well, we got one of those anyway. The dash is invaluable there. The dash is invaluable there. Oh, that was a lucky kill there up on the right. I thought I'd move the face cam as well. I think I did this an episode or two ago, but I don't know if I acknowledged it in, in video. Um, I just realised that there's often a lot of stuff that happens in the top left where the camera usually is. And, oh, don't do that. And so, yeah, that's why I, I moved it. <laughs> Do you like me in the bottom right? The 
game likes them in the bottom right. Right, one health left to do the last two phases isn't great. Especially when you do that. <laughs> Come on, right. Back to focusing, I'm talking too much. Okay, no worries. Just have to try and avoid that dodgy light bulb one. Went too early. Good. Good. Too early again. I'm getting, yeah, get a bit itchy trigger fingered about moving for these guys. One health. Well, again, use it as a test. Never know. Didn't even see it. Must have been an extra dog. Good that's day for us. Well, uh, Thank you, Austin. You're a treat. They have a set amount of health to begin with. The phase transitions are set at certain percentages of their health, so you assume it carries over between them. I th thank you. I thought that made sense. I mean, that that almost um, confirms it, doesn't it? I thought that would make sense based on what I witnessed before. But I wasn't 100% sure. So that 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 does help. Thank you. Good start. Thanks for catering to my uh, prima donna moment. Where I'm like, oh, no one's listening to me and answering my questions. I'm a streamer and I need other people to tell me how to win the game. Nice. Phase. Still on full health. Got the special we weapon ready. Oh, that was close. But we're fine. We're good. So actually it does make sense, unless you've got a really horrific phase that you don't want to play. It does make a lot of sense to, uh... Oh! I need to not jump into those so soon. It does make a lot of sense to use that early, then. You use the big, the big uh, fighty thing when you've got it. This, that's such a shame, because we've had a really, really good round here, and I've made two very, very bad movement mistakes there. Down to one health, but we'll, we'll see how this goes. love to parry that, but it's not happening. <laughs> ah! Let's just get used to jumping on these. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Good day for us. Ringa, you're a feeder. That's what you are. You're a feeder. You're one of the best type of people in this world. Playing it close to the edge with that. Annoying that I lost that, but never mind. Right, so I guess as soon as I get the next special, I should just use it. And I need to stop killing the purple dogs, pink dogs. That was close, wow. Oh, but then straight to another one. That's the trouble with parrying those. Sometimes new ones just appear that you weren't expecting. Go. Oh, and there's a bleeding dog. <laughs> a great plan and then some. A great plan and then some. That what you reckon I've got, huh? Oof. Not the best start, huh? Good, the duck's gone. Ah! Oh. That's a horrid start. 
I think we're just gonna have to rely on all the parries we can get now, aren't we? Is okay. Hey Mr. Sidescrape, welcome to you. Let me try that. Good day for us. Well done. But thank you. Welcome to you and I uh, hope you enjoy. Lovely to have you. Oh, come on. I, how have I suddenly got so bad at this the dodging? Get red now, go. Right. This is where we don't... That's where we do that. Yes. Exactly. Good. Right, we're getting better at this. And we even got a pink ducky. Agree, trying to parry a ducky. Never mind. Two health, we've had worse. Some of those dogs can get really awkward. Just the way they uh, stop talking. <laughs> no, the way they the way they traject towards you. It's traject of verb. I don't think it is. I think I hit B by accident. Okay. So I'll have a quick breath and a, a moment's break while I pour my new drink. There we go. I can't believe we're so close. This is what we like. Good start. One more pink and we are set for a, a decent super. We'll just do that. Hopefully not get hit. We didn't get a hit. That's really good news. Trouble is now we're going to spend a lot longer on... Oh, I freaking parried it. Come on. We're going to spend a lot longer on phase three. Oh. Shame. That was like the perfect start. But never mind. We'll manage. That's fine. Please keep doing those. It's all right. Perfect timing with the roller coaster. Perfect timing with the roller coaster again. Yes, got that. Have another one of these. Nice, okay. We're going down to one health in the second round. I, I, I'm pretty pleased with the performance on this one. Breathing helped. Keep breathing. You need to breathe to stay alive. <clears throat> Ooh, hello. Should really start parrying that nose. I think that's probably straightforward to do. Oh wow! I, I just fell off and, and couldn't really go anywhere. Didn't do badly. Good. Yes. Give me that duck. Give me that ducky. I 
I guess as I said before, we could just farm that first thing for... Because it's pretty straightforward. And we could probably just farm it for um, as many things as we want. As many uh, pink parry things as we like. So we've got all the cards. I guess. Good. Maybe. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. That dog's going to get me. No, it's not. Ah! Oh, have that. No. Nope. That's the wrong dog. What game is this, Steve? First the wrong dog? Uh-oh. Good. Cool. I'd like some more. Flirt alert. Ruru, we've been watching these back on the TV. Suffering with you and cheering you on. Take no prisoners. Thank you so much, Ru. That, uh... I consider that taking a prisoner. <laughs> when I... Oh! When I try parrying two things and miss both of them. Not my finest attempt this. Actually, phase three isn't that difficult. Maybe I don't use the thing on phase three and I save it for phase four. But again, like we're through to phase four without much effort. Even though we're on one health. Really want to get there with three health. No, distraction. I've called them distract alerts before, so you're all good. You're all good. Plus, no, not parrying that. Forgot about it. <laughs> okay. These are really hard to spot. They are so tricky to spot. Those balls. But thank you so much, Ruru. It's a pleasure to hear from you and uh, very, very kind of you. Glad you've been suffering through it as well. <laughs> that's, the, uh, that's the emotional support I need to have. Come on. Damn, such a shame. Yeah, I, I used the the graphic of it coming, the, the the train coming in the background. That helped a lot to know when to expect it. Although I did forget it, I always forget it in phase four because I'm so like, paying attention to all the stuff that's on screen then. On screen, you know what I mean? It's all on screen. Yes! Have that! And that? Yes! Good, 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 good. That was an almost parry. It's like a, I consider it a lesser parry. I definitely hit that! Mm. Alright. <laughs> Damn, I was trying to get some more pink dogs. It's fine. Two health is good here. Especially with the train coming. Oh, come on! I got that spanner. That horseshoe, rather. Spanner? But it looks like a spanner, doesn't it? Ooh, spanner. Yep. Niceness. Hopefully. Oh, my goodness. Distract alert. Hopefully I can get enough damage in that I can get the super special weapon before penguins start shooting their balls at me. Ah! And we're going to keep an eye out for the train. Here it comes. Jump. Oh! I'm not quite sure what happened there because you heard that. Never mind. Are you happy to deputise Ringa as horror store pet? Could be the start of a franchise. Thank you so much for the super chat, Billy Reynolds. Very kind of you. And yes, Ringa can be... Um... Horror hey, store pet, if she wishes to be. She can brand herself differently. I understand that horror store pet might not be the uh, most attractive, <laughs> most attractive name for for her or indeed for her viewers. But uh, if, if Ringo wants to play horror games instead of me, she's welcome to it, and I, I would thank her for taking horror out of the world, out of my world. Thumbs. Do you know? Speaking of horror. Um, Sparrow and I just recently watched uh, Annabelle Comes Home. What's that? Annabelle 3, I think it is. And it wasn't that bad. I, I won't give spoilers away. I'd say that the first two thirds of the film were excellent. Damn it! The first two thirds of the film were excellent. Well, whatever. And the, uh, the final third was mm, a bit much. Good day, 
and it sort of over overplayed its hand a bit. But yeah, if you want just something that is just essentially a haunted house um, scary, a haunted house scary film kind of thing, which is just loads of really good atmosphere to begin with, and then unbelievable creative scares, then that's a good film for you. Oh, I blimmin' heck! <laughs> you know what? I might have to... I know we're so close on this one, but I think we might just have to take a break from this guy. Should we say, if I don't do it in the next three attempts, including this one, I'm going to go back to the flying genie guy. Sound good? Yeah, that's, that's the thing. You wouldn't use your big move so early. Um, I, I, I almost entirely agree. Oh, come on! I parried that freaking dog! And yeah, you're right. I think I think it's a decent thing to leave the big move, maybe in, right until the end, because this phase is pretty straightforward, as long as I'm not you know, doing that and talking. So I'll shut up for the next attempt. Um, but yeah, if I save it for the final boss, then that means that I've got a really decent chance at beating it, because that's easily the hardest phase. I, I wouldn't say I've mastered the other phases yet, but I think I've, I've pretty much got them down. Good. Good pink duck timing. Okay. Nice. No, don't! Stupid homing thing. <laughs> no, use that now. Just get a little bit of extra damage on there. Straight into a dog. That's unfortunate. I absolutely parried that. I'm, the parries annoy me. Um, because they're, they're basically... They're basically... Um, Necessary. But, mm, no. Not good. Right. Yeah, yeah, because you think you're going to... Oh. I, I get that they're tricky to execute, but like, I do not see what was wrong with my last attempt at a parry there. I, I honestly think I did it perfectly. I suppose it was moving away from me, so let's not blame the game. Clearly, I, I, I don't understand as well as the game code understands. So I can't start claiming that it's uh, it's broken. But it's a toss-up, isn't it? If I use my uh, if I use my big weapon early, it means I lose less health during that time. But it also means that I don't have it to get through a harder phase later. So, yeah, we'll see. Right. I wish you could swap out your charm mid-game. Mid-fight. <clears throat> Wanted that duck. Just get you over with. Here comes the light bulb duck. No you. No you, like Bob Duck. Right, we're on three health. Can we try and keep three health for this, please? But I'm not going to parry the dogs unless it's really simple. Because I'm, I'm doing really badly with those. Like that one. That one's a really good one. Ooh, that was a slightly lucky dodge there. Dash. Whenever I say dodge, I mean dash and vice versa. No need to parry. There's no uh, benefit to parrying when you already have full cards, is there? Right? Makes sense to me. I'm also not going to use it on this guy. Just focus on killing. Just focus on shooting and dodging. There you go. Straightforward. Here comes another one. Because this, this phase is easy. Really. And, and he has very little health in this phase, see? 
There you go. Now we've got all our health and the super weapon. Turn a clock. Which superpower do you want the most? Also stay safe and happy. At flight. I think flight would be the absolute best, followed by invisibility. Thank you so much, Turner Clark. I really appreciate that. That was an excellent place to land as well. Thank you very much, game. It's fine. Sugar. Oh, I didn't get anywhere near. Hmm. Thank you so much, Turner Clark. I really appreciate that. I said three more attempts, didn't I? I don't know how many it's been. But I feel good after that one. That was a good one. It's just paying attention, not losing sight of what you're doing. There goes the pink duck. It's fine. Well, no, no extra pink dye there, but that's fine. We didn't need it. Yeah, I don't avoid all parries, just some of the really rubbish ones that are really, really tricky. Uh, on especially what? Oh right, yeah. On fights where you definitely don't need to be doing them as well. So, hey, you didn't need to do that one, but I did it anyway. Shame I lost a health further. There, there you go. Oh no, the train's coming. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. Haha. -ha. That I am sure I parried, but again, the game code knows better than I. <laughs> it registers the inputs, not me. <laughs> that was that wasn't good. I definitely parried the green Here's one. A real high class Okay, this is the last attempt of this boss in this video. And I started off by just jumping on the boss. You know what? Give me that light bulb. This is the last proper attempt. That was a suicide. Bat. Okay. Show me about that pink duck, but never mind. Can't have more. Whack, 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 whack. <laughs> Good. That one's fine. Oh, I was looking to see if he had the light bulb and got hit. Yeah, we do. We need to change this up. Oh, I didn't quite parry it in time. Oh man. This game, I am going to be so happy when I've completed this boss in particular. This one is so tough. Right, I'll get some more pinks soon. In fact, I don't need to parry these dogs. I don't need to parry them because I can parry the nose. I'm going to get enough for a supercharged weapon just anyway by doing this thing. Oh, I didn't actually have enough. That's a shame. And I ran into it. Well, okay. We're going to exit the map there. And on the next episode, I'm going to be working on a different boss. But we nearly got this. Time will tell. See you on the next one. Thanks for joining me. Bye-bye.